All right, pay attention because this video is for you guys. I'm going to skip all the baloney and cut straight to it. To get into tier two, you need to unlock any five presets from any of the trees combined to be allowed to play tier two ranked. So you can unlock one tier two class in CQB, one tier two class in Assault, and three tier two classes in Scout to be allowed to play tier two ranked. You do not need to unlock five presets in the tier two of Scout to play it. Now that we all understand that, the tree that you should be going down in the beginning is the scout tree for multiple reasons. To start off, going down the scout tree is going to be mad fun. This goes for all the people who solo queue and 5 stack. Since everyone in the game can only have one of each preset per team, this will benefit you because you can use multiple classes from this tree that are viable. On the other hand, some other trees will have you questioning what to use when someone takes your class. You can go down the left side of the tree and right side of the tree and always have classes to use when your class gets taken. Going down this route will lead you to two presets that are beastly and usable once you get into tier 3. Let's take a look at what we have to go through to get to the bottom of this. When you get to the bottom of this tree, you will have two options to choose from when someone snags your class. You will thank yourself later for grinding this route. Personally, this will save your KD in the beginning of the wipe going this way. Let's take a look at what the number one class is going to be and why you want to go this route. Starting off, let's take a quick look at Handler. This class is the definition of run and gun. MP5K with PST, GZH, 54 damage and 20 penetration. This class is better than 90% of the other starting classes, and you will be shredding everyone else who are going the opposite trees. Here are a few clips using the MP5K showing how easy it is. Before hopping into that, I want to give a huge thank you to everyone who has been watching and subscribing and liking the videos. If you are not subscribed, subscribe below to join the Rise of Mushu's Empire Chapter 1 before we make it. Thank you, and enjoy the rest of the video. He's pushing left lane. No, no, I'm far left. I, I, I only have 60 bullets in the mag. For 20. I got, got him. Yeah, got me. Nice. Get Let's shit go. on, bitch. <laughs> I like that. Get shit on, bitch. Get shit on, bitch. Fire. Where's on their platform? <laughs> My God. Where was he? I got the It's not. I'm getting lit from the right. Oh. Hopping over to the next class, we have Geronimo. No disrespect on his name, this is what we are calling him. So far, this has been my favorite on this side of Scout, and here is the reason why. He carries the UMP 45 with .45 ACP match, FMJ, and does 72 damage with 25 penetration. Can't forget to mention a nice red dot. This class is great and will have your KD rising. Let's take a look. Just free them my side. My game is like uh playing me right now. I don't know what's going on. My god, bro, I'm literally lagging. Another one there. Mid. The enemy on the pass, yeah? Yep. Dead. They didn't fix it yet. Oh, I didn't know you were doing that shit. My bad, I'm gonna Nice. 
Oh, get poopy on. Finishing up in the tier one left side of scout, we have Vityaz, who holds a PP19 with PST GZH ammo, doing 54 damage and 20 penetration. Personally, I would use the UMP or MP5K over this, but every gun isn't for everybody. Something you may use may fit your playstyle better than it would fit mine. The 20 round mags on this gun hurt it a lot, but it is a usable class on maps like Chop Shop, Equator, and Bay 5. Let's hop into it. One's top plane. One on the site, German. There are steps, I think. Yeah, I lit him. He's in German. Two of them, German. Left side platform. I, I lit him up. Uh, I'm. German dead. One of them. Okay, one more. One's on point, left side. Dead. One was on left platform. I don't see him. German dead. Zef blood, Zef blood. China? No, not out. Burger dead. I'm in German. Overall, choosing this route, you get good class after good class, nothing you have to really struggle with. Now we can run down the rest of the tree, which gives you Sawbones, who possesses an AK 102 with M856A1, 52 damage, and 38 penetration. Great class. Going to the next class, we have Saboteur, who owns a PP-19, 20 round mags, holding PBP, GZH, 52 damage, and 39 penetration. Still a good class. Now a look at Blitz, the last class before the two great classes, who has an MDR with 20 round mags, M856A1, doing 52 damage, and 38 penetration. All three of these last classes have good penetration to go against any of the CQB classes in Tier 2, which some have face shields. This will slice through them like butter if you hit them in the face mask and not the side of the helmet. Okay, on to what we all have been waiting for and why we are going to grind this class to begin with. We have the Weaver, a beastly class that can compete with anything this patch. He has an AK-74U that has basically zero recoil, 30 round mags, BSGS, 43 damage, and 54 penetration. When you are solo queuing and someone snags Grumpy from you, your second option can be Weaver who is versatile on all the maps and can compete against anything. Lastly, we have Grump Master Flex. I believe this is the best class this wipe. We are grinding here for purely the gun and its bullets with a good headset and a nice amount of heals. 90% of your gameplay should be sound. Hearing is the most important element in this game. Holding the M4A1 with M995 and 4 30 round mags doing 42 damage and 53 penetration. This class easily has the best gun. The only slight downfall here is his level 4 armor that is tiny taking the new hitbox detection into play. It does not cover your armpits or neck. Overall, this will end up being the most played class because it is simply the best. Thank you everyone, don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Once tier 3 comes out, I will have gameplay for you guys on all of these classes. See you all in the future. Leave a comment on who you think is the best class this white.